Adamson has a twice-to-beat edge, a player who seems to love burying daggers in the heart of University of the Philippines, and the mental edge of having swept the Maroons in Hoop season 81. But it's not like the Falcons own every edge in their final four showdown with the Maroons. Bo Parasol, up coach, feels his team has some sort of an advantage after finally making the final four for the first time in two decades. Actually, the pressure's already off, he told the Inquirer last week at the new Epsilon Chi Center. The pressure was for us to be in the final four. The pressure lies within the task of making the most of what we have, Parasol said. What's important is that we're given that chance. Adamson lies in Up's path. The Falcons own a 2 0 sweep of Up in the elimination round. And the Falcons know what Up is feeling right now. Just like when I took over, during my first year, coming from a cellar dweller, we went all the way to Final Four, said coach Franz Pumeran. That's the same scenario for Up right now. Hopefully, our crowd will be there also to at least give us additional lift. And while forward Sean Manganti has dealt up hard X this season, nobody believes this series will be decided by one player. Manganti has been playing well against us, Parasol said. It's something we need to address. Dot to say he's the one who beat us all together? I don't think so, Parasol said. Adamson has a very good team, I think everybody contributes and everybody defends. We need to defend Sean as well, but what's important is we need to do it as a team. Dot I'm sure their focus is on me, Jarek, Ah and Missy, and Poppy, Sar, said Manganti. But you know, you can't put a price on the guys like Simon, Camacho, Jonathan Espileta, Jerem Lastimosa. Those guys do things that don't show up on the stat sheet. Dot, dot, every team needs those type of players, and I'm just glad we have those players who could step up, you know, he added. They don't care about playing times, and nobody in the team cares about stats. Nobody's a patter. Everyone just wants to win. We all want the same thing, we all have the same goal. Dot the two teams collide on Saturday at 3.30 p.m. at Mall of Asia Arena. The day after, farther up north at Araneta Coliseum, top seed Ateneo takes on no. For Far Eastern you both Ateneo and Adamson need only one win to advance to the finals. Up and Fu need two straight victories, to do so. Ateneo coach Tab Baldwin who doesn't fancy labels, wants his Blue Eagles to forget a tag they rightfully earned last season, defending champions. We don't consider ourselves as defending champions, he said. That's another team. That's another time. And I think our potential is significant now, he added. The 2018 team has to stand on its own merits. On Sunday, this current Ateneo squad can begin earning its own merit against Fu, the team that pushed the Blue Eagles to the limit in last year's Final Four and upset Baldwin's boys in the first round.